All right, so if we just come up here and grab this, and we can just fling it around. <laughs> what is up, you guys? Today I'm going to be showing you how you can pick up an object in Unreal Engine. So the very first thing we're going to want to do is we're actually going to want to open our character. I'm using the first person template for this, and so I'm going to go into the first person uh, blueprint. And from here, you're just going to want to use the key that you're going to be using. Uh, I'm just going to use the F key, so I'm just going to find uh, F key. There it is. And then when this is pressed, we're going to drag out, and we're going to do a line trace by channel. Line trace by channel. All right, so the next thing we're going to want to do is we're also going to want to get first person camera or the camera that you are using. And then from here, you're going to want to uh, get world location as well as you're going to want to get a uh, forward vector, get forward vector. And then from this, we're also just going to be multiplying this by a flow. And we're basically going to be setting up the like camera positioning for uh, lining or trace up for the object. All right, so now what we're going to want to do is we're just going to connect this in for our start. And then what we're going to do is we're going to do a vector plus a vector. And our world location is going to be connecting into this as well, which then ultimately goes to the end point. And then off of here, we're going to drag and we're just going to get a branch node. And then for our hit or out hit, we are going to break hit result. All right, so now what we're going to want to do is go to add component and do a physics handle. And what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to drag this in as a reference. And then from here, do a grab component at location. And then just connect this in for true because if this is true, it's going to be activating like the grabbing process, if that makes sense. Open this little drop down, and then hit component is going to be our component. And then for the location, do grab location. From here, you're going to want to go up to mouse input, and you're going to want to drag out and do um, set target location physics handle which is basically the code that we just did and copy and paste this for both and for our uh actual like locations here what we're going to do is we're going to go back and we're going to get everything that we just had for the first part and getting our locations and then just come up and just kind of move this around a little bit, make it neat so you can kind of see what's going on and then just connect in for our new location and for our new location as well. All right, so lastly, there are a few things that we need to do to finish this. This is your distance, so basically set this to whatever you think is gonna be best from the object before you can pick it up. And then from released, you're gonna to want to drag out and you're gonna to want to do uh, released physics release component physics handle and basically this will ultimately give us like uh, the physics that we need for our object when we release the button all right so now if we just compile and save and we come in and we hit play I don't know what that was about all right uh, but if we walk up to the object and press F we can pick up our object and then we can throw the object by just releasing it.